Okay, in this video, I will be showcasing the new weapon added to the new Mink Piece update, which is dropped by Unel. And I have to say, this weapon is pretty unique compared to any other weapons in the game. First things first, the Electro Fighting Style passive actually works with the staff. This means that if you hit the enemy four times with the staff, you will create a small shock explosion. Now let's get on to the moves. Starting off with the F move, perform an acrobatic spin that deals damage four times to anyone around you. This move is pretty reminiscent to Kurobachi's H move. For G, you swing the staff, dealing damage two times. You also ragdoll the enemy with both of the hits. Now for the H move. This is where things get interesting. Upon activation, you spin your staff vertically, dealing damage four times to anyone around you. But, if you have Goro as your current fruit, the H move will be replaced with this. So now you have a trident, and with this trident you will have two new moves that replace the previous F and G move. For the F move, jab your enemy four times in a row, dealing some quick damage. And for the G move, throw the trident towards the cursor of your mouse, dealing damage to your enemy, while also ragdolling them. And if you want to switch back to the staff, all you have to do is just press H again. Some important notes that I want to say about the trident is that Electro's passive doesn't work with the trident, but in exchange, the damage is a lot better than the staff. So overall, I think Goro users are definitely going to be happy with this weapon. The Trident can deal some pretty good damage with the F move, while only having a 4 second cooldown, and that is pretty nice. The G move is a bit... meh, but it's a nice ranged move to have. For the staff itself, it's not really great for damage. Comparing it to the Sword Styles and the Kurabachi, I think the staff has the lowest damage compared to the two, which kind of sucks. But if you have Electro, you're just going to be ragdolling the enemy for days, and that can be pretty fun. And it's because of this it creates the main problem that this weapon is very, very conditional. Like, if you don't have Electro or Goro, then you're just better off using the Sword Styles. So that is about it for this video, I hope this has helped you guys. Forgive me if I sound a bit dead while recording this, it's because I am. I'm running on like 5 hours of sleep, and I'm also sorry about the fact that I'm like 2 days late for this, I was really busy during the weekend, and yeah, that that's about it, I, I don't know what to say, <laughs> so yeah, stay safe.